Expansive, explosive, and honest. Three words could not be more apt to describe Buck Super Rugby. And after 17 rounds, 161 days, it all distills down to this match. Durham University versus Northumbria University. And Buffett's over, Murray Wigmore. Big forward carries from the back row, Jamie Adamson. A recent returnee from the England Sevens camp, carrying forward as Durham spread wide to one of their flyers, and boy, does he fly! Paul Brown streaks across, and it's first blood to the Palatinate. Yeah, lovely finish by Paul there. Uh, something we identified in the week was just giving our outside backs a bit of the ball, just one-on-ones, giving two and twos. Got a really quick set of backs, and um, yeah, lovely finish there to get in the corner. Have possession. The call to go wide. It's fast hands, looking for the edges. And breaking through the first tackles. That's Max Pepper. Up to the 22, Craven goes for a dark. Craven streaking free. And it's try number two in merely minutes. In that five meter line, uh, nice press from Paul. And we've got a bit of a shift ball focus on turnovers, which we really tried to adopt this week. It was something we analyzed. And um, again, another tough, tough kick for Will here. But it's an ideal start there. Since sitting on the bench, primed and ready to go. And at the moment, it's the boys on the field who are doing the business. And there goes Braden Barrett. He's got his other flanker in support. Jamie Adamson showing us what he can do when he's got a bit of space. Nobody's going to stop the back rower. Yeah, lovely line there by Braden. But I think Northumbria will be a bit, be a bit disappointed to get broken that easily from the halfway, especially off they've disrupted a bit of set piece there, putting pressure on Harry the nine um, on that pass. But Will, Will Nick's done really well there to take the ball down. And lovely finish by Jamie. He showed, again, that seven spark that he's got. He's really dangerous. He can beat a man. Sorry to have to defend in training. His ability to show you up. Ewan Murphy out the back door. There are numbers here for the Palatinate. It's how they use them. Wow, and they use them through Max Pepper. Ollie Walker does fabulously to stay on his feet through the contact. Yeah, Max is one of those boys like Paul, our wingers. We're really lucky with them, them two. Uh, Max a fresher here, Paul in his second year. Um, Max also involved with England Sevens. He's on their cards. He's a real dangerous, dangerous player, and he, he's so quick. He pops to one of his big forwards. Nicholson. Paul Brown away, how has he done it? The crowbar breaks through an impossible tackle with no room on the far side. Excellent finish there from Paul. Again, just see how quick he is off those 20 meters. Um, for us, a bit lucky there. A few passes going behind the man, something that we really try and drill our own standards. But there you just see Paul running in. Got such a nice running style and that's another one for him this year for Northumbria in that line out to disrupt it. Durham get up and down well, and they launch again through the back line. Good hands seeking the edges. And don't you just know it, Paul Brown's lurking in support. Craven, it's a tricky ball to gather, but he does so well. Yeah, it's lovely work from Nick Jonas there. Um, I think Paul's presence has maybe dragged a man out there who's so scared of his pace, and Jonas has ghosted through the gap. Great tracking from Harry, like all good nines should do. Um, but Harry for us has been, you know, we've had a few of our staples there. You've got Freddie going to Moran in the line out for a strong set piece. In a couple of weeks. Open play, play on. Yeah, a really frantic start here to the half. Uh, looks oh, open up here for Max. Lovely offload away. Here we go. Durham on the assault. And Durham coasting across and under the sticks. Yeah, similar break against Beckett last week and the pass wasn't quite there in almost the exact same sort of scenario. Uh, slightly worse conditions, but great pick up there from Harry. Just takes his time here and lovely two on one and easy roll in for Mikey Ford, the fresher there. So 
so well in the league. Hands away, Black! Speaking of acquitting themselves well, Durham on the hunt for 50 points. Carrying through the back row, a scramble from Jamie Adamson. An infraction and Marion Hoos gets his try. Um, first more we've had this game actually. Northumbria did well to disrupt it in the end. I think they were swimming through there, keeping the binds though. Um, but there, we can just play at different tempos when we pick and go. Apart from the first one of the night has More. been supreme. And as predicted, Bristol Bears bound Freddie and Davies out. latches on. Northumbria do well to swirl it initially. It's got hey, the momentum down. of a runaway Palatinate freight train. Championship <laughs> crowning night without that man getting across the whitewash. On the back of a mall as well. I think that's what all 22 have been from. But it's also a credit to his throw-in and the drills we've got here. Our fours coach, Nez, yeah, and Keezy. It's, it's one of those things that they really focus on every week. They drive the standards and... Coordination and splintering through opposition, forward resistance. And Northumbria are continuing to play and they find the gap eventually. And it's try time for Joe Lilly. A last ditch tackle. Not enough from Paul Brown and tireless tonight. It was Zach Thompson, that little delay to seduce the extra defender. And wow, it was a brilliant effort from Brown. Four are confirmed in terms of their home playoffs. It could be anyone of Swansea, Cardiff, Hartbury, Leeds, Beckett, Bath. Here we go. Is it hat trick time? You betcha. It may be Durham's night, but it's Paul Brown's town tonight. A hat trick for the Palatinate Flyer. He's here getting from edge. Real nice focus off set piece. Good ball from 40, holding it up at the line, staying square. Nick doesn't do too much there, just gives it Paul on the outside, and it's just his gas and his natural pace which gets him around there. And Northumbria are circling the wagons. Durham keep pressing, they keep finding the seams. More direct. Head down from the forwards. A dart for the line, short. Adamson looks to make his a double. Reaching and scoring. See him all along. You know it's coming, how do you stop it? And that just little telescopic arm. Jersey's flooding round the corner, Marion Hoos. Will Durham finish this one in style? More numbers round the corner. Oh, and Harry Craven. Looking to match Paul Brown's hat trick. Fumbles across the line in the dying moments. But it matters not because the victory is emphatic. The title has been decided, there is no doubt. The best team in Bucks Super Rugby, the champions of the league are Durham University with victory. Over their northeastern foes, Northumbria, 67 points to seven. It is Durham showered in glory. In purple Palatinate rain of champagne. Durham University at Buck Super Rugby League champions.